The day began with Senate Republicans and Democrats caucusing separately behind closed doors. Democrats who control the Senate must pick an acting president to serve during Stan Rosenberg's leave of absence, following his announcement today that he's stepping aside during the investigation into sexual harassment allegations against his husband, Brian Hefner. Rosenberg said last week he would recuse himself from the investigation. But today, announcing he's going one step further, writing, I believe taking a leave of absence from the Senate presidency during the investigation is in the best interest of the Senate. I want to ensure that the investigation is fully independent and credible and that anyone who wishes to come forward will feel confident that there will be no retaliation. Even before Rosenberg's late morning announcement, his colleagues on both sides of the aisle were expressing concern about his role on Beacon Hill, even if not directly involved in the investigation. I think he has to think uh, long and hard about whether the Senate can operate uh, during the pendency of this investigation. I think we need to focus on those victims. I think we need to focus on the integrity of the institution. And again, at this hour, Democrats are still caucusing. When that concludes, we do expect a joint press conference between Democrats and Republicans here in the room here behind me, at which point we may have a better sense of where things are going from here, who will preside over the Senate temporarily and who will lead the investigation. Reporting live inside the Statehouse, Todd Kiskevich, WCVB News Center 5.